Kia ora, I'm Stevie and I love to play basketball. I'm just practicing because this weekend I'm playing in the Māori basketball tournament held right here in Rotorua. This is my Tiarua A-Under-11s team in red and black. The girls are cool and I've made lots of friends. This is the Energy Events Centre in Rotorua. This is where the Māori basketball tournament is being held. Hundreds of players from all over Aotearoa come here to play in this massive tournament held in Rotorua. They represent their tribe and it goes from under nines to 45 plus. They celebrate being Māori and of course, trying their best to win. Come inside and meet my coach, Matua Dud. He's just about to take us for our last training. Matua Dud, tell us why the Māori basketball tournament is so special. To me, the Māori basketball uh, tournament is so special because it is one of the biggest platforms for our people to express uh, and have the opportunity to express themselves. And two, it's a, it's a great foundation for them to learn tikanga and to speak and to communicate in te reo. Now tell the viewers at home about our team and be honest, how do you think we're going to go? Mm, considering how we practiced over the summer, uh, we were there in drips and jabs, but I think we're coming together nicely. We'll see. Hopefully we get the best out of everyone, eh? These are my cousins, Mariah and Joyce Makiha, and I'm also here with Matua Doug's daughter, Amaya. They're going to show us how to do the perfect layer. Let's go, girls! She plays in the under 13s. She scored an awesome three pointer in the team's finals that helped them win gold. Check out Mariwa's awesome three pointer. So, Mariwa, how does it feel to nail those three pointers? It feels really good um, because the crowd goes wild and yeah, it's very really fun. One of the coolest parts of this tournament was performing our waiata at the Kapahaka night. So far so good, we've had three big wins and we're into the semi-finals! <laughs> Well, that was a nail-biter against Hoka with one point in it. Yeah. Lucky Joycey got the last yeah. no, point at the end. Finals, here we come. Yay! Yay! Well, finals time, and I was so nervous. Matua Doug has taught us resilience, technique, skills, and most importantly, sportsmanship and being humble. We played our best, our goals were sinking, and our defense was on, and we managed to come out on the top against Hedatonga from Hawke's Bay. It was such an awesome feeling. We finally did it, gold medal, the girls got it, and I'm so proud of them. Uh, all the hard work that they put into it has finally paid off. Awesome girls, 2021 champions, yay! As a mark of respect to the second place getters, we performed a haka totoko, and they were given their silver medals. <laughs> The gold medal is the ice cream cake, but just remember, it's always important to get out there, get moving, make some friends and have some fun.